Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how I can change uh, my IP address to a USA one. Now I'm based in the UK and because of that when I connect to the internet I get a UK IP address which is fine, it lets me access a lot of the things I want but frequently I get blocked and the reason for that is lots of the the great sites I like to, to use like Hulu, HBO, Pandora, NBC and ABC and stuff like that um, are restricted to people with a USA IP address and I haven't got one. Now I did some investigation in this and I found out there is a way you can change your IP address to a USA one but first of all I just want to um, highlight a confusion. Basically you've got two types of IP address. You've got an internal one that works on your internal network and you've got a external public facing IP address. Now the internal one is assigned to your wireless card or a network card or whatever like that. I'll just show you mine here. Okay 192.168.1.16. Um, basically there's absolutely no point changing that if you want to access different sites because nobody sees it. So it's kind of irrelevant to any website you go to or any um, forum or anything you do online. That is not relevant. Okay, So don't worry about trying to change that. It will have no effect of what you can do online. Just wanted to point that out. Okay, It's the external IP address that you need to change. The um, internet facing one if you like. So let's just look what happens to me if I go to something like Hulu. Um, let me just have a look and try and watch something. You'll get this message, okay? Hulu's looked at my IP address, seen I'm in the UK, and uh, I get this message. So I'd, the same would happen if I went to um, HBO or Pandora or anything like that. And conversely, this similar thing happens the other way. If people, uh, people in the USA try and access things like the BBC or uh, M6 Replay in France, something like that. Okay, so we're kind of all getting a bit restricted by these things. Let me go and change that now. I'm going to show you how you can change it. Now, I use a security program called Identity Cloaker. Um, now, it's a, it's a paid program, but in a sense, it has to be. Because um, what you need to do is use an, uh, a proxy or VPN server and channel your connection through that. That's the only way you can hide or change your IP address. Um, your IP address is assigned by your ISP. So unless you own your ISP, you've got no control over it and you can never change it. You certainly can't change it to the IP address of a different country. So what you have to do is basically hide your real address. And this is what Identity Cloaker does. It hides your real address and gives you access to this big network of um, super fast servers all over the world. Right, and I'm just going to show you now. Um, now there's loads of countries, they're all included. I'm going to show you a US one. So let's just go to a US one. I'll pick the fastest. I've obscured these mainly for security reasons. It's best to keep them private. Okay, let me just connect and I'm connecting now to a USB IP address. Now all my web browsing is currently routed now through one of Identity Cloaker's US servers. Okay, so any website I go to will not see my real IP address. I'm completely anonymous to it. They will see my US IP address. Okay, and just to sort of demonstrate to you here, um, I've actually been routed through, I don't know if you noticed, to the... Um, the google.com instead of google.uk now because google has seen that let's just start let's try and watch the same thing we did now this thing let's just stream it and i've clicked on and you can remember last time i got blocked and it wouldn't get access now i'm getting the adverts and it's going to stream all this um i can get a full account there i just have to make sure that um my IP address is enabled. I'm just going to stop that now, but I hope you can see that um, I've now got a US IP address and any US site will let me watch it. I can also go and watch Canadian, French, German, all sorts of different sites all over the world. It works very well. There are free options out there, but they don't really work for video because this, they're very, very slow. And you have to be careful. A lot of them are run by hackers and identity thieves. And they set them up so that they can try and steal your information when you're using them. Um, they are out there, though. Try Proxy.org if you want to risk it. 
Um, I would really recommend one of the um, services, though. Identicloak is the best I find, but there are others. Have a shop around. You can see some others as well. Okay, well, that's my um, change IP to a USA address finished. Um, thank you very much for listening. Bye-bye.